and China will keep the yuan exchange rate stable at a reasonable and balanced level. So says Premier Wen Jiabao after the 12th China-EU summit today in Nanjing city of East China's Jiangsu province. This is the first time that China has held such a meeting outside of Beijing, reportedly because of the province's active role in Sino-European trade. Li Zongwei takes a look. Premier Wen chairs the Nanjing meeting along with Swedish Prime Minister Frederick Reinfeldt and European Commission President Jose Manuel Barroso. Wen told reporters after the summit that some countries are demanding appreciation of the yuan and meanwhile practicing protectionism against China. He said such actions are unfair and are aimed at containing China's development. Wen said China would take its own gradual steps on the currency front. He added, maintaining a steady currency is an important contribution to world financial stability. The China-EU summit started in 1998. This year, China and the EU signed five cooperative agreements covering technological cooperation and energy efficiency. The two sides vowed to control carbon emissions. The EU side says it will provide up to 57 million euros to a joint project named Near Zero Emissions Coal. Last week, China pledged to cut its carbon intensity by 40 to 45 percent from 2005 levels by 2020. The carbon intensity is a measure of the carbon dioxide emissions per unit of GDP. The latest moves came ahead of the December Copenhagen climate talks, when world leaders are expected to discuss an ambitious and operational accord. Li Zongwei, ICS News.